Well, some go off to college, but the goal for many kids after high school is to land that adult job. But a state program that helps students make it in the real world has just taken a huge cut. And new at 6, KSNT Capitol Bureau reporter Corinne Griffith explains the possible impact to Kansas kids. The Kansas Jobs for America's Graduates program offers classes in schools across the state. This helps prepare students for life beyond high school. Cassidy Brunin started high school struggling. My grades were awful. Cassidy joined the JAG program at her school and she says this completely changed her path. It was just like a family-like environment and they really helped me with school. They really helped me with my grades and they're just really good to talk to. Cassidy has already been accepted to nine colleges with scholarships, but the JAG program is not just for future college students. The program teaches hands-on skills for any post high school career. In our job, our passion is to help those students identify that path that meets their goals and their definition of success. But the JAG program is at risk. The federal government will cut the grant that funds a large portion of the programs by 50 percent in July. The hope is that with bipartisan support in the legislature and with Governor Kelly now serving on the National JAG board, the funding won't be lost. I feel very confident that it will get filled. For Cassidy, the program was a life changer. That teaches kids how to be better versions of themselves. Representatives from JAG hope that legislatures will allocate funding for the program next year. At the Capitol, I'm Corinne Griffith.